flaming game that shelters me I can't understand, I don't commit Whenever time I seem to pop the clip Stupid shit and stubborn lips I seem to trip, I ain't even crip Gotta fuck myself and no money and blame Where do I go, when do I see this rain? Does there lie something more to me? Is there something the eyes can't see? Hey, uh, hey, uh, you're the man in me You're the goddess that's saving me Hey, uh, hey, uh, you're the lamb of thee You're the baddest face of my dreams Hey, uh, hey, uh, you're the man in me You're the goddess that's saving me Hey, uh, hey, uh, you're the lamb of thee You're the baddest face of my dreams Can you take it off? Can you take it off? Don't break me up Don't break me up Can you take it off? Can you take it off? Don't break me up Where to go? Every thought to try just fades away I'm not clean cheek, just lost in hell But don't mind me, I can't be held How do I love and enjoy my days When the love for others seems to creep with pain Where's the star that shines for me Rewipe my tears and misery Is this a crime of my thoughts, no mindfulness Can we slip this belt? Is the a scuff that could be clean I'm pristine but tipped obscene do you come along the way while I am lost, while I bathe? Do you breathe all my air when I am stuck and cannot bear? Hey, hey, you're the man in me, you're the goddess that's saving me. Hey, hey, you're the lamb of the, you're the baddest face of my dreams. Hey, hey, you're the man in me, you're the goddess that's saving me. Hey, hey, you're the lamb of the, you're the baddest face of my dreams. No, 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 where do I go? Where do I go? No, 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 where do I go? Where do I go? Behind, only found in line. All right, so it was a little offbeat, but uh, that's just an example of my first CD. I never, I'm never ever officially gonna release uh, uh, a, a song or vocal track because I just don't think it'll sell. Primarily, a lot of it's explicit and kind of negative. Cards and tell them to go there. So, anyways, Kyle just wants. So he wants me to share a business card, or if I can find it. Yeah, so basically... Hold on a second. This is just the QR code. It's it's Where's actually a, it's a bio link. So it's lift.bio slash monopark. Okay. L-I-F-T dot B-I-O slash M-A-N-H-O-P-A-R-K. And that is an example. Okay. So what would you rate this product on sound quality? You know, uh, I don't... Price? I have no... I, I mean... It, it doesn't beat another, another product would never beat like 60 bucks. So relative, it's relatively cheap. There are some that were like 20 or 30, but obviously one got like three and a half stars. So I didn't want to, I don't want to buy some crap. So I went for the higher version. I know there's some that, that go up to like 250 bucks, 300, but I didn't want to spend that much easier since I don't make much money as a music producer or whatever you want to call a composer. This is a pretty good, if you just do it as a hobby, and I am more of a hobbyist anyway, but please check out duotracks.com, duobeats.com, realgroupstation.com, and the QR codes there list all of the links, my YouTube, Bandcamp, SoundClick, and Spotify and Apple Music for streaming, so please support me. Uh, I don't really share too much of it, but anyways... That's it. Anything else? Yeah. What would you so, uh, this uh, does I give the sound quality an eight? Okay. The the design a nine because this okay. it's nice that the trouble also comes with a boost to our air pocket or whatever you want to call it. And the prices, I want to say it's like at least a 
maybe an eight for the quality of sound. So, so pretty happy. Bought this of the price. Or so guys, like the, the one thing I do have to know is that I feel like as a music producer, I feel like having it connected does uh, require better song, but I know there's a Bluetooth connection for this. So be very careful because every time I always take it in and out for, for various reasons, like when I need to move my, my laptop, but be very careful about moving the, the cord between the TSR and the, the wire because if that gets snapped or broken, you're going to only have one speaker like this, and that's really... Kind of what that sucks. So. Quite a long time, though. Yeah. Okay. So I mean, my brother had something like this too, but he, it's not it's still like working. It. He, this same one. Yeah, it's still working for me. Oh, so he, he has another set that he's never same actually one. interviewed. But anyways, clean it out. It's gonna be a. It's gonna be a, a mess. So anyways, that's it. Okay, please. Look. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe, and hit the bell button for future videos. Thanks. Take care. Have a good one. Bye. And this is. Could you say this is? Uh, Travis uh, reviewing whatever model number it is. So this is Travis reviewing uh, the, the the Logi Z313. So anyways, that's it. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe. Thanks. Anyways, this is just a shameless plug, but I produce music. I have over 270 tracks, including songs, instrumentals, and beats. These are two physical albums. One is a piano album right here and the other one is a orchestral album the piano album has 17 tracks the orchestral album has 19 tracks they're on sale for five bucks a piece or eight dollars for both of them these are really original i know not a lot of people have cds but it'd be great for any donations if you want to buy them what makes it personal is that the original art is by colin me and one is a graphic art and the other one is acrylic artwork that Kyle and I done together. Anyways, that ties something else, which I also do art, so I do hyper-realistic artwork. As you can see here, just some examples. And I do airbrush portraits, and as stated before, I do abstract acrylic work that I often do sometimes with my brother. But anyways, please go to lift.bio slash monopark. Once again, it's L-I-F-T dot bio slash monopark, M-A-N-H-O-P-R-K. So please like, comment, subscribe, and hit the bell button. Take care, have a good one, bye. Annyeonghaseyo, hello, this is Travis and Kyle. We are both artists and we focus on hyper-realistic drawings, acrylic work, airbrush work. So I also wanted to mention that we actually have our own channel as well. Our channel is Korean Adoptee Stories and we interview a lot of adoptees. Uh, we found that with adoption, there's quite a few adoptees that struggled, unfortunately, and did not have the best kind of life and a lot of them had mental health issues. We felt like it was important because us, we can kind of struggle with that.